saving items. Fucking nothing. Is there something in here? Is it including the down... Oh, there must be something in here in the corner. I doubt it. Oh, Not make... for a second. Look, oh, no, look, at, look at that. Look how right I am that. this one time. Yes. I don't know if you know this, uh, viewers, but I get to be right about something once per day. I usually use it at work because it's pretty critical to my job, but... Eh. <laughs> in this case, I just had to use it for the... Uh... Oh, nice. Combo. I like that grenade launcher a lot. I also like that grenade launcher. Like, it's no RE2 grenade launcher. For some reason, there's, like, a military grenade launcher that has ice, fire, and acid rounds. <laughs> but what can you do? What can you say? I guess I'm going to want that. Gonna Weren't want... there G adults in RE2? Uh, yes, there are. Do I, do I need anything else right now? Um, take one healing item with you. I'll take... Save us all the time. <laughs> or a first aid spray. I don't fucking care. All right. I love that it's a revolver. What, what am I doing? You're Where's... going behind you. You came from there. And wow, then... good save. G GS, GS. You know, that actually is a good save. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's... Mm -hmm. Wrong way. No. Oh, you're right. Ha <laughs> ha! No, the prophecy. That's the wrong way. <laughs> the prophecy, no! <laughs> Can you hear me? <laughs> I also like the revolver. I'm surprised it took care of the first form of Birkin so well that first time. Well, yeah. Yeah. Is there anything? It's... See, I never has... I think you just have, like, trauma over that first time you lost. Dude, I don't... I don't know Will what was you? up with me and Leon there. Because you're wearing, like, a waterproof suit. I think... You'll I... actually... This is, like, the one situation in which you can be in this environment and not smell that. Well, but your hair's out. Where's the thing? What thing? There's a there's a there's a gunpowder here somewhere. Forward to the left, I think. Yes. What? Yeah, yeah. I feel like uh, mm -hmm. I feel like this is a pretty shitty scenario. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Woo! But this action is actually surprisingly short. For some reason, I recall it. Maybe it was longer in RE2, like the like Resident Evil 2 original. Yeah, I I completely agree. Well, no, but like I thought in RE2 the original it was hardly a place at all. I thought it was just I, like ten rooms or something. Yeah, God, it may have been. It's been a minute. It's been since like two thousand three. No, way before like nine. Two thousand one, two thousand. Nothing over there. I was, I was a wee exactly lad. Over there. Oh boy. Oh geez. It's fine. Yeah. Don't forget that. Good. The, the, the uh, SCF. SC. Oh, oh, probably is SCF. What was that? Fighter Alpha. What is, why is it Z though? I think it's a, a name for it in Japan. I don't know. Some reason Vega and Bison are different people, but the same person, but different people. I see. I was crushed when I learned that Dr. Robotnik is actually the shitty American name, and it really is Dr. Eggman. <laughs> yeah. That, that hurt me when I was, like, in my teens, and I, like, realized... I was, realized... like, 25. <laughs> <laughs> this morning when I found out... Oh, raccoon milk! <laughs> so good. Ew. Great. What? Imagine. It's the it's the milking a raccoon. Imagine milking a raccoon. That's the grossest ever. It, it, raccoons can be milked. I'm scared. I mean, I guess most things can be milked if they make milk. I mean, you can milk spiders. Well, but that's different. No, no, it's totally the same. It's, but it's not a nipple. It's a spinneret, and it creates webbing stuff. No, no, it's the, those are the same type of body part. Okay. I, I hear you. <laughs> Counter. Oh, Chaz is rapidly going Counter. to the internet. Um, they are invertebrates. And they do not have synonymous parts to mammals. Okay, counter, you're thinking of horses, which do not have synonymous parts to mammals. Horses have uniquely a similar amount of synonymous parts they to They do humans. not. Say that to my fucking I, face, I Chaz. I am A, and B, horses, <laughs> awful creatures. That's what, that's my whole point. Do we all agree? No one arguing, no one here or at home is arguing that horses are not awful creatures. <laughs> They're like, they have weird bulbous eyes that are all weird and like crazy fucking teeth. And they're really big, and they poop all the time. And what's up with their toe-knee situation? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. They're awful, awful creatures. They smile at you more human than a human could, and it's awful. The rock where they run around on two legs. Ugh, I hate when they go bipedal. That's my least favorite part. Um, God help me. That's <laughs> nightmarish. Um, with the exception of that one horse. Uh, James Baxter? Uh, no... James no. Baxter. <laughs> no, that from one? the game. From the game. 
Uh, oh, uh, Child of the Colossus? That's a good horse. Uh, no, not that one. That one's terrible. I meant the oh. horse from Harvest Moon 64 that you win money off of. There we go. I, I cannot I cannot say if that's a good horse or not, but I trust you. I trust you and your horse. Uh, well, that was a bait to sick on. on um, what's the horse's name? Is that a document? Yeah. That's a document. Oh, oh, it's a Leon note. I actually really like these Leon notes. I think they're fun. Where he just writes it and is like, yeah, be careful. Yeah, because I think they highlight how much of just... Just kind of a doofus Leon is. If you made it this far, you're almost out of the city. I've got to take care of something before I leave, but I need to tell you something in case I don't make it. This was all Umbrella's doing. Let the people know, Leon. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, like I, don't, I, I get that he's in a rush, but... But why would you write a no if you're in a rush? Why would you assume that Claire makes her way down to here? I don't know. It's, it's uh, 2 12 Elf. Is there anything even useful in here? I think it was like a stupid bullshit item, right? No, it's the reinforced thing for the pistol, which we will want oh. later. Will we? Yes, yes, we will want that later. Blech. Blech. Just, not gonna blast him. There he is. One time, right in the dome. What? Right in the dome. Okay. Hell is up with you. Nope. Oh, you fucked up. Maybe. Two times, right in the dome. Okay, okay. three times, three right times. in the dome. Oh, that basically works. He's not gonna be a problem later. Gosh, I fuck him up. I fuck him up, chest. <laughs> you heard you. Oh well, fuck. <laughs> oh, you got greedy. Oh, such greed. These are the these are the wages of your sin. One more time in the dome. Yeah. All right. Just, <laughs> just one more time. This won't affect our uh, our our time. We're still set to take the the world record. Okay, sure. Now I just fucking leave. It stopped. Are you sure? I should try one more time. Okay. There we go. There we go. Five shots in the dome. Five shots in the dome. More than enough to kill anything that moves. <laughs> okay. So I'm finding a lot of images of raccoons drinking milk, but no images of raccoon milk. Type in raccoon getting milked. <laughs> okay. Okay. No, no, don't type that in, Chaz. God damn it. Because that's gross. Milk raccoon. Raccoons having a bowl of milk with Muriel. No, a, 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 a milk raccoon is a raccoon that's been bred to milk, be milk. God, it's nightmarish. <laughs> a mechanic they don't use enough in the base game is having you switch, uh, have the revolver and switch out the high powered and low powered ammo. What's that? Um, like I like I wish there was more of a reason to switch out the high powered and the and the regular ammo in that revolver in the base yeah. game. No, in the base game, there's... Yeah, you're right. You don't fight any of the um, the, the cool regenerator guys. Which I think would make a pretty big difference. Uh, I feel like they were around, right? But I think I think I mentioned this earlier. Maybe it was during the... When we played the, the DLC separate. I think it's one of my favorite weapons in the game. Just because it's really interesting to have the different ammo types. Right? You get that with Claire and not really with Leon. Yeah, I agree. Oh, God fucking damn it. It's okay. Jeez. It's inventory management. It's the, the real game. Are you sure you don't want also a green herb? I'm get, yes, I'm getting the green herb. It's because I'm so good at inventory management. I'm too Man, fast. It's true. The game can't keep up. Yeah, I. You need a a, a Bakugan to see. Damn it! What's the thing in his eyes? Oh, fucking a Sharingan. A Sharing a Sharingan. What is a Bakugan? <laughs> that that the that the one with the tops? I I yeah, I think it is. I was at PAX uh, Emerald City Comic Con <laughs> this year, and for some reason there was a giant Bakugan like part of the show floor. It was huge. It was by far the largest like floor thing. God, why? Yeah, that, that's a. Oh, I forgot there were two. I'd imagine that these zombies are like just trying to get a job. Right, and everywhere we go, we just run through and ruin their lives. Because, like, the exact same four models, right? Oh, absolutely. Boop. Did we get the basement upgrade? The basement upgrade. Yeah, the, the on your way to um, uh, the first fight with Birkin. Did I fuck myself up right now? I don't know, did you? I grabbed way too many items just now. Just throw a grenade at a G-Adult. I, guess so. I guarantee you're gonna grab IG adult because we're playing the game like <laughs> on on air, right? So keep that handy. You're gonna need it. No, I, I'm actually 
pretty okay with the G adults. I You also thought we could complete this in like four episodes. Dude, okay, it's gonna be it's gonna be uh well actually we're on the sixth episode. I forgot to make the cut again. <laughs> oh, great, there we go. Hey, welcome, welcome back, back to the <laughs> You've already been here for nine or so minutes, so So hey. Hey Just checking in. Oh, I really fucked up my items. I can't go there. Why not? Throw a grenade. You have a grenade and a healing no, item. I... And another healing item. This is terrible. I'll grab that key on the way back, maybe. Uh, yeah, sure. Whatever. Okay, or now. No, no, you're right. I mean, I'm right. <laughs> By you, I mean me. <laughs> the royal me. <laughs> so just ignore the items on the way there. Why? It's fine. It's because you already have enough items. Oh, look at this. Doesn't make any sense. You're just complaining about using too many items. I need items, Jazz! No, you don't. Also, that's the wrong way. Well, you know, sometimes you mess up. Like I said, I'm great at this part. Okay. Are you ready for that to combos against yourself? Okay. Go in. Oh, no. It's a G-adult. Oh, wait. Okay, you went too slow. Run. Wow, huh. Better than I thought. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, yeah, 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 you're right. Route B, Route B. Yeah. The zombie's not there in Route A. I was confused and scared. Yeah, there there will be two Zambambos on the way back. And it will make me very sad. Oh, mm -hmm. I think I... F Dude, I fucked up a lot. You're fine. You don't need the full RGB herb thing. What if I do? You so don't. <sighs> Very few things I'm sure about more than you don't need those. <sighs> but what if? Oh, I mean, you, I, you I need to get irrevocably to the fucked up. Chaz, if I don't get to the final boss with 12 herbs in storage, it's like I'm losing. You already have enough herbs to go through the whole game. That's not enough for herbs. What? What am I? So doing? you go forward. So the, oh, Jesus Christ! You take that. You place it. You go upstairs. Guy will fall down. Grab the thing down there. Jump down. Oh, and there are two Zambambos in here. I think as oh. opposed to the... One Zambambo in the base game. Yes. Good. Like You're gonna blast him? Alright. You're um, gonna regret not blasting him. Oh, there it is. Well, you'd be surprised by how few things I can regret. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's pretty good. I like that. Uh, you don't need oh. that. You need to go back through and open your way back up to the... Oh, shit. Wow. I'm just gonna take care of that right now. Oh, fuck. It's okay. He's very slow. He, but he's got all his limbs. That's a quitter right there. He's very limmy. Maybe it's like full body day. <laughs> it looks like the other guy's going to have to miss leg day. Oh! <laughs> so this is a weapon that I never really used and... Eh. Um, it's cool. I like the spark shot. I mean, it's a really cool weapon. It does have that little interactivity that Leon, frankly, totally lacks. Um, <laughs> wow, brutal. Uh, that's true. None of his weapons are like, I mean, the shotgun feels the best of all the weapons. It has that, that feeling of like, this is a, a, a gun that shots things. Hence the term. Shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> if you will. Now I go through here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. God, what is that? Queen. Mm-hmm. That's the problem when you make weapons that are too good and satisfying, like the shotgun. It's true. Yeah. It's like flying, uh, flying with Delta. Or using Hulu. <laughs> Brought to you by Hulu. <laughs> and Gillette. Oh my god. Is they have a different face than usual? Uh, oh. they switch up the faces sometimes. <laughs> Maybe. Unless they don't. Hmm. So I consider that weapon very good into the Geodults. I take it back upon review. Well, which which I only discovered in the Ghost Survivors. Ghost I, Survivors. I don't think I'm gonna need to use it here. I I'm probably gonna use it on a Zambambo. Let's still show it off for our viewers at home. Yeah. Well. Okay. No, on the Geodult. The Geodult? Really? I don't see why not. Oh my God. Jesus. So it's slow and like. It gets multiple enemies, it's not so great, but it'll kill pretty much any enemy one charge shot, right? Right. Like, there, it's a Gadult. Blast him. Oh, but see, that fucks okay. me up, because I should have just kept You're going good. forward. You're good. There's one. Perfect. Now the other one. But it doesn't actually kill it, Chaz. <laughs> Don't give up. Now that one, too. Blast him. 
Oh, now you fucked up. I can't believe you're throwing away your chances like this. Dude. Dude, this is like the worst. I should have. No, you're mm -hmm. fine. Use your grenade. Or your machine gun. They can't reach you up here. I've been the most powerful of G children to get you. I'm gonna jump up and grab you now. Yeah. It's fine. It's gonna try to grab me. It's gonna be like, oh no, why do I suck so much? Why does he suck so much? Yeah, the right jump up. No, you take a left. Take the left. Oh no, I know, I know. I was okay. I was juking to the right, hoping it would jump up on the right, but I see. I did you see that transition on the right? Yeah, I don't know what happened over there. That, Are we recording? Uh, yes. Okay. Well, you say that, but this multiple times that's not been the case. Oh, oh shit! No! <laughs> Fuck you in particular, oh, I guess. Get out of there! Get it grabbed. Well, that was very exciting. Wow, that guy got really fucked. Uh, but that was on purpose, so now I can get the key. See, all, all according to plan. Jesus Christ. Um, so go, you want to go back and then? Oh no, you're right. You're right. You're right. Right, because now we want to go to the workroom. Work Stop room. by the RPD. RPD. Try to get chewed on by this dude on the left. Leg be gone! It just makes such little noise, it seems less threatening. Then when you see it really just kill something super hard, it has this level of humor. It does. Like, it uh, like just explodes into viscera and you're like, wow. Like, like that's a machine gun. That's a gun, alright. Uh, I'm gonna- certain nobility to the Mac-10. Hmm, <laughs> hmm. I'm dropping off some items. I know this is somewhat of a waste. That's the wastefulest. Uh, just get rid of two of those. You don't need. Okay. Oh. I now you have no guns. I know. I know. I'm taking a pistol. It's gonna be great. Hmm. Chaz, you know. You know. Look! Look how much gunpowder I have. It's not enough. Something's wrong with you. Uh. Yeah. That's probably good, right? Sure. Yeah. 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 Hmm, hmm. <laughs> I want a knife. You ever just say that to yourself? Sometimes. Like, man, I could really go for a knife. Mostly when you, like, text me on, like, Fridays, being like, I need to need a knife. Well, okay, look, I... A, I'd appreciate if you don't speak about that on the channel. Uh, B, uh, what happened to the promise of never speaking about that on the channel? I never made that promise. We didn't sign it in a, in a contract written in human blood and bound in human flesh. Uh, I always forget that's the... Can I just run by this dude? Yeah, I could go hard right. Yeah. That's, I think I have to take a right here. I think I can... Just yep. dodge on the grab. Grab his Mackenzie. Oh, no. Yeah, you're fine here. No worries. Don't become anxious at all. Just... Everything is perfect. And so if we want to, we could just um, grab this and then turn back around and then you're done with the sewers. Mm -hmm. But... Uh, we're going to do the speedrun route. Which um, is to go all the way back to the RPD and get the second upgrade for your third weapon. Yes. Which is technically, I guess, like the fifth weapon for Claire because we're but, in route B and we have a bunch of unlocked weapons. Yeah, this is cool. Uh, and so normally there'd be a pouch here, but... Um, no, not there. Uh, oh, I'm thinking the workroom. The workroom, there'd normally be a pouch, oh, nice. but... It's going to be an ink ribbon. What does ACP stand for? I don't know. So I'm not going to get that yet. Wow. Well, because if... See, it's actually called a workroom skip. If you get bit there, you can then use... You the can die and ace. go straight to heaven. Yeah. Oh, oh, this might be bad. Oh, no. Just need it's to all go, good. Can I go hard left? Hard left! Wow, well, you did it. Now we'll simply push this. Uh oh. Later, nerds. Oh, well, not yet. So I'm really curious if you can just, like, run. Right? Like, in this event, like, at this point in the infection, could you just, like, run out of the city? Like, just, just really book it? Just really, just, just go for a jog. Because, like, if you're, let's say you're, like, really fit. Like, let's do the best case scenario. Okay. You're a so marathon me. runner. Right. Oh, yeah, sure. Like, you can... You can just run for like 15 miles and that's like a half marathon if you're a marathon runner. There's a good amount of people who can run 15 miles even if it's pretty tough. Right, right, right. Well, especially if it's that or die. Oh, I hate dying so much. Yeah, that's one of my 
least favorite things. It's in my top ten. Yeah, yeah, definitely top ten. I don't know about top five, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, because like, I guess maybe they're all blockaded off the thing. They just like ran up, and you're like, hey, because the U.S. military is there. Right, and they'll shoot the ones that are near you and let you in, and they'll be in like a weird camp for a while where they check you out, but then you'll be fine. But then, like, also the uh, umbrella countermeasure service, right, is there, and they're like saving people. Yes. So there's like a lot of ways to escape. I don't know. Yeah, I agree with that. Uh, sorry, quick, quick thing. What, what do I? What do I want here? You just you're fine. Just go to the ink room. Yeah, I guess I'll just run around the SMG more. Like you're you're fine. The zombies are mostly gone. You don't really even need the SMG. You can if you want. But I, mean, like, I don't think the zombies are mostly gone. I think they're around. Okay. Is there another thing you can do with the workroom key? Mm, yes, I think there's another door that just makes it go a little bit quicker. But you don't need it right at this point. Huh. Okay. Uh, I guess we will stop by the east wing. Hmm. Get things developed. Mm -hmm, hmm. Uh, not I mean, to the west wing. To the no, dark room. No, I kind of want to grab that. Oh yeah, the ammo in the, and, and the kniff. Well, I'm not even that worried about the kniff. Well, I Maybe guess if, if, if we're you, over there. If you got in the rest of the you'd have the infinite kniff, which has a diamond blade. Wait, really? Yeah. Is that is that why it's infinite? Yeah, because it can't break any diamonds. Okay, so even though in reality it would just be like sharper, <laughs> not necessarily infinitely durable to shearing damage from <gasps> pulling it out of a skull. <laughs> Well, maybe all you really need is something that's, like, pretty sharp. Uh, yeah, I guess we might as well get the kniff over here. It's, like, literally right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it is right there. All right. Er what? No, I'm not gonna, just right there in the next room. Oh, oh, in the... Oh, God, this room... Kind of, it kind of looks like the next room, don't you think? Yeah, sorry. Ah! Ah! Oh, man. Why are there so many Zambambos? Because you didn't kill them. You bypassed them. Alright, let's not get that kniff. Ah! Where did that person even come from? Wow. That went right through your super armor. It did. Hardcore. Wow. Wow, where did, where did those same bambos come from? Maybe they spawned after an event happened, but we didn't come back here because we'd already like been ahead of it, right? Because you, you did a lot of running around upstairs. I mean, I thought you were going to go back down then the main floor. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess so. I guess that's... Yeah, or, or maybe they spawned specifically here. I don't know why they would, because why would you go to the East Wing? Only fools miss the knife. That's true. And cowards. Oh, oh boy. I, I hesitated there for a second because I was worried about a liquor. And you may ask, what liquor, Tony? You may also ask, Tony, why don't you have your gun equipped? <laughs> Both of these are valid questions. They are. I will not answer any of these questions, but they're mm, valid. Mm. Will that heal me to full? Yeah. No, it'll show me a man of health. Mm. It's on the description of, of that. Well, but I have like no... Okay, whatever. Um, whatever. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, can you develop things when you're... When it's, when yeah, it's you can. It's, I, remember, it's 1998 slash 2019. Oh, it's a hiding place. So, who took that picture? Was it Wesker? Because that's his office. That's a great question. Is Wesker canon in this game? I don't know. Because he's never mentioned. Never mentioned at all. No, no, he has that weird picture of uh, Rebecca. Oh. Well, he, it, it's not that he's mentioned. It's like he's around. Like, yeah. in that sense. And, like, she's the only one that he considers even kind of a human. Wait, is that true? Yeah. It's, oh, yeah, so you might not realize that, but Rebecca at, I think she's 22? She has a PhD. Well, she's really smart. In, in virology. <laughs> like, and so because Wesker also, fun fact, has a PhD. What? Yeah, he's like super fucking smart. He developed the legendary ultra mega virus, like on his own. Wait, 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 wait. That was him who developed that? Not the G virus or the T virus, but he was fucking around. He was part of the research team for the, um... <sighs> Whatchamacallit virus? The progenitor virus? Oh. Right? Gotcha. So he's even like he's even like in a lab coat. And then he's just like also moonlighting as the stars captain because they have control of the city. And based on the idea that he would then be able to uh 
be the first person sent to anything that could be actually an umbrella side if I can get combat data. That's why he knows Birkin so well. It's because they like work together. And they hang out oh. in the events of Resident Evil Zero and they like watch stuff. Or maybe he doesn't have a PhD, but he's equivalently smart to having a PhD because he's sure, a right. biologically enhanced superhuman even before he becomes half a uh, mutant. He is? Yeah, he's part of the Wesker children who were like trained in like the the Warhammer style umbrella scholar progenium to be like super children. Well, I always assumed that they were like trained well, but like. Yeah, but they all die except for him and one other because oh, okay. the training is so intense. Uh, and hey, look, it's Claire. Rising rookie. That's not Claire. That's or, Rebecca. Rebecca, who we just talked about. <laughs> um, okay, whatever. So I got it. I have a I have a sick SMG. Later, you will see me just annihilate Birkin mode. Uh, Birkin three with it. It's Birkin. gonna be great. The SMG really? Yeah. Oh, neat. Yeah, I mean it just. It does a shit ton of damage. It doesn't feel like it does a shit ton of damage. It's so quiet and incredibly accurate. Uh, yes, quiet on account of the sick upgrades we got for it. Mm, mm, mm. And accurate on account of all the sick upgrades we got for it. Oh, oh god. With that notebook we can know what... Uh, what combination to unlock the... Uh, garage? But, well, no, the statues. But mm. I do that. Should I save here? So, like, this is also canonically part... Of the police station because always there's police station memorabilia here, but Marvin and no one seemed to know about it, and they were all surprised. And I was like, "Oh, it's a secret passage, <laughs> right?" Yep. And then in Resident Evil uh, Outbreak, you also—that's the whole point of one of the missions—is you're in the uh, the police um, station, but before everyone else gets there, because like the beginning of the outbreak, and your mission is to do the exact same thing, get the pieces, and they you escape through the garage, and that's the end of the that's the end of the scenario. I imagine they were just doing that because it's like, oh, it's like an RE2. Wow. Yeah. Well, it's interesting because the game, you fight way fewer zombies because the zombies are way tougher. Oh, in Outbreak? Really? Yeah. Yeah. Because they, I, I think they actually can't die. They do all just get back up after a while because they're zombies and you're not superheroes. That's awesome. Yeah. No, it's, it's really cool. And so there's generally fewer of them. And there's usually like one or two like area specific types of zombies, like plant zombies or a zombie elephant. Um, oh, right. I forgot about the, the zoo section. There's a zoo. There's a zoo scenario. Um, God, we still got to check that out at some point. Like because a, that would be sick. Or like an axe man if you're in the hospital one. An axe man? He's a man with an axe. He's an axe man. Um, I hate being axe man. Me too. But, um, oh yeah, but there's just like way more zombies, right? It's like, yeah, let's just play with the zombie concept and you're in the police station and there's just like shit tons of zombies. And by that, I mean there's like five or six zombies. <laughs> and you're like, how do I deal with this? Because you can't pause the game, right? The game doesn't pause. Right, because it's all online and yeah, it's all—it's like a live. The man has a beard, or is that just like weird lighting? He has a beard. I, I don't know what's gonna happen out here. You're fine. Keep going. Kill that man too. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost pathetic. I don't need to go over there, do I? No, I'm fine now. You have the three electronic parts. There's no sense in. Wow. Well, I knew he was there, but. Well, did you, but did you understand that he was there? <laughs> oh, but was that my good knife? God damn it. Very dead. Give me that. Oh, still alive. Now very dead. That was not worth it. I no, this was a false mistake. Oh my oh, god! Oh shit! No, you've already invested so much resources. You invest oh. even more. Invest, invest, squander. <laughs> Shut up, Chaz. That's how I do. He's she's so dead. Where's the knife? I don't know. It's maybe inventory. Oh, this sucks. Yeah. Well, <laughs> that was like that's a life. That's a lot of ammo. That was like a hundred <laughs> submachine gun rounds. <laughs> and that knocked out. Isn't there an enhanced ammo? Upgrade. Oh, oh shit. Oh my dude. He's just going for it over there. I shock him. I don't have to shock her. I don't. Uh, I just want to go to the uh, right, right, right. right. Yeah, it's the right. It's it. You'll take the right. Oh, and then go up the stairs. Got yeah. it. Oh! Not that right. I'm at the right at the fork. Oh. Oh. It's fine. We're ready to dodge and stop his grab attack. I'm not gonna dodge, Chaz. Oh, I know. I'm just gonna run really good. And like sidle weirdly. Yeah, that is kind of a weird animation. I was just thinking about that. Maybe it makes more sense when she has more like like her jacket or something. Or I, I don't know. Think so. I think it's just a weird walk. Because I'm I, I don't know. I haven't I had to hustle through waist deep. I should have taken fluid a left. Very much. No, you're fine. Oh, it would have been a lot easier if I took a left. Why did you not kill the zombies in here? No, I didn't kill any of the zombies in here. You know I didn't kill the zombies in here. Damn it. Yeah, but you'll do it perfectly. Watch. 
There you go. Dodge one. Nice. Oh, perfect. Sick combo. What? <laughs> Uh, and so now there's an interesting section here where we see if Tony remembers the solution to this puzzle without having to read the notes four times. And I think it's going to be really interesting if you check out the next episode of Press A Gay. So thanks for watching, everyone. If you yeah, enjoyed the video, everyone. please watch the uh, other ones. Hit the subscribe button. That's what I meant to say. And if you like this content and these games and other games that we've played so far, please consider clicking on the Patreon link in the description of the end card um, and kind of review our things. Uh, we would love to have your patronage. Goodbye. Bye.